Ladies and gentlemen, that is an icon. Yeah, the Icon A5 is really unique. Okay, yeah, it's got one high wing. It's got sort of a little baby wing on the bottom. That's called a Sponson, and it's an amphibian. That's what they call a light sport aircraft. Only has a limited amount of horsepower, only has a limited amount of speed, limited around a range, only two seats. The Icon A5 built out in Vacaville, California, and this one is based on Interarity Point. The owner is Gene Valentino. You may recognize the name. Uh, former Escambia County Commissioner, and he digs it. This is this is where he loves to fly. This is his happy place. Look at him come on in, and let's see if he does some splashing and going as he goes. All right, there's a tent in my way. It's hard to see. But the water is just perfect. The winds are fabulous. Good for seaplane operator. There we go, one splash. And should be another one here. Yeah. I've done that. I've been in that plane with him and done that. And it's a, frankly, it's a little bit scary, but you realize it's supposed to land on water and then he bounces out again. It's just fun. And that's what airplanes are supposed to be, right? It's called a splash and go on. If you're on ground, it would be a touch and go because that equals a landing and a takeoff. Here, it's a splash and go. Actually, I think his wife, Maureen, Valentino is flying today. She's also checked out in the airplane. I think she said last night that today was her turn. There you go, good good view of it. And it's to the point where you can actually, if you have the setup, you can trailer that airplane. You can, it will drive down, the, it'll be towed down the road with no problems at all, with no problems at all. If your airport, you know, is a few miles away. Otherwise you can land it, take it up the boat ramp, and then hook it onto your pickup truck and drive home from the lake like that. You get the idea, look at that. I wonder if the guys in that Coast Guard cutter are really appreciating this like we are, huh? There's a maneuver, let's say if he runs it in there for a while, where you just sort of leave the tail in the water for a while, they call it jet skiing, there you go. That, that's the idea. You just pop the tail in the water and it, you sort of get the bounce out of it. Gene says it is absolutely the most fun flying he's had and he's been flying for I don't know, 35, 40 years. It's been a while. Anyway, that, we wanted to get that out of here because it's the only one in this part of Northwest Florida. Uh, the only one in the Panhandle, as far as we know. And it's just so different. We thought we'd share it because you, uh, you know, next time you're out in Perdido Bay or the intercoastal somewhere just offshore a little bit, you might see an airplane come in and land on the water. Then you're going to start 911ing, right? That's where the plane's supposed to be. That's why they built it. That's why it's so much fun, because you can go from the runway to the lake, to the bayou. You can need a long bayou, but you get the idea. Again, just a two-seater. Easy day, take off here, fly over to New Orleans, have lunch, fly back, that sort of thing. Down to Panama City, and believe me, it'll be way quicker than that than it would be <laughs> driving down 98 through Destin. Anything's quicker than that, right? And this is one of the very first air shows that icons have ever performed, ever. That's also pretty neat. He's popping up, and he said, "Yeah, I'm going to try to clear the uh, clear the pier." I said, "Gene, real good idea. Clearing the pier. They're very much in favor of that. Do not, don't be tempted to land on it." So, so that is the newest when it comes to technology and seaplanes. Coming up in, in just a few minutes, our next aircraft is also an amphibian, lives at Pensacola International Airport, has flown 40 plus states, four or five Canadian provinces, and pretty much every island in the Caribbean. You'll see the difference in technology. Oh, but what 60 years of technology, what kind of difference it makes. So there you go. Great look at the Icon A5, uh, piloted by Gene and Maureen Valentino. Uh, I don't know who was taking controls today, really. <laughs> 